Our experience has been very good. Uh, we focus on mapping populations um, at small spatial detail. Um, and the UN has a big focus across all of its agencies on leaving no one behind. So, and that means now um, measuring factors about development, um, about health of populations at small areas. So they're very interested in approaches that can help to fill gaps and complement existing um, national statistics. Uh, UN agencies have a remit to support governments, particularly in low-income countries, on producing these estimates, on supporting their census, and on helping them get uh, improved, smaller area spatial statistics. So it's been a natural marriage, really. We've, we've come together at different meetings. Um, we've developed our collaborations through, uh, through workshops together um, and through partnering with governments to support them. The collaborations are very important. Um, we produce methods, uh, integrate data sets um, to try and answer questions, uh, but we don't really have the, the insight as to how the, the research that we do can be used to best uh, meet the needs of vulnerable populations, to meet the needs of governments. So the UN agencies have, have that remit, have that long experience, have in-country experience, and can help make connections, can help feed back information to us as to what would really be useful on focusing our research uh, and, and provide a, a way of opening doors of, as a conduit to those governments themselves for, for us to be able to present to them and, and keep that discussion going. My advice would be to be patient, firstly. Um, working with UN agencies and, and governments, uh, it can be, can be a slow process. Um, we, if we are on our own, working in our, in our academic labs, we can make progress rapidly. Um, but often that, that doesn't come with the, the end point of, of changing policy, of, of, of having that, those outputs used. Um, working with UN agencies, um, it can slow down the process. They have the unenvi an unenviable task of um, getting consensus across governments and uh, government departments, and that can take that'd be a long and, and political process. Um, but the end point is, is very worth it in terms of seeing your research actually used and adopted by, by governments around the world.